Hi, I'm Donald Wade, and thank you for joining me for today's daily devotion. Today I'd like to do a reading from Philippians, the fourth chapter. And it reads, Rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I will say rejoice. Let your gentleness be known to everyone. The Lord is near. Do not worry about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Word of God, word of life. You know, this reading talks about joy. And really, joy is an inside job. It's, it's not the rush of emotional energy released in moments of victory or success like we've seen maybe this past week in the Olympics. And it's not that feeling of happiness that, that sweeps through us when we experience some good fortune. Because joy is not dependent on outward circumstances. It's deeper. It's, it's rooted in the soul. And joy rises when, when the heart is warmed and filled by the, by the presence of God living within us. God is, God's love is always there. It's, it's in us. It's, it's our truest self because we are made in God's image, an image of immeasurable love. But the problem is that most days we, we kind of live far from that awareness, which is, which is why prayer needs to be a daily, hourly, almost, almost a moment-to-moment -moment experience. When we're speaking with God and listening within to the one who is always near, moments will come when we are filled with the simple joy of being. Because God, God who, who is love, fills us as water fills a glass to overflowing, washing away all cynicism, all fear, all boredom, all bitterness, all greed, and all guilt, so that all that remains is the gentle joy of being alive and knowing the love of the one who is and was and is to come, the love shining in the face of Christ, the love who is in all of us. Yeah, we should rejoice in the Lord always because the Lord is near. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, fill us with your love so, so that we may live in the joy you alone can give. In your holy name we pray. Amen.